struggling with volunteers on a Saturday morning and obviously with the foundation we've got Sam who's already helping out, he's doing a cracking job so we approached the foundation basically for help to help the club develop as well. The foundation has been brilliant to be fair since, since they've come in. It's, 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 took, it's took a lot of pressure off the club really because we haven't really got to now organise the, the volunteers to help out but, and so that they've come in, they've helped and I think, it, I think it's probably a better quality of coach as well to be fair because obviously they've got, they do it day in, day out, so they've got a, a lot more experience. So it helps develop the kids as well. I'd recommend it to anybody. It's a non-brainer. It was the best thing I think we've done, to be fair. It's not about trying to take uh, players off other teams or any other grassroots teams. It's about giving them the chance to have the whole pathway from the grassroots all the way through to the academy. Um, so any way that we can do that, whether we can get them in at grassroots and then signpost them to the PDC, Player Development Centre, um, then that's what we're trying to do as much as we can. Uh, not just for Walsall Wood Saints, but also for, for other teams as well. I have um, four uh, young coaches that will come along. So they are players that have played in or play still at an older level for Walsall Wood Saints or Shire Oak. Um, they will come down every Saturday, they will help out, they will come and do some of, some of the coaching. So it's about giving them the opportunity to learn from myself and the other West Brom coaches um, and then hopefully that's a career for them in the future.